This video quick guide provides an overview of how to measure the real ear to coupler difference using the SPL probe and the software that supports the Affinity and Callista. In order to perform an RECD measurement, it is necessary to select a protocol that includes the RECD test. Use the protocol drop down list to select such a protocol. Typically, measuring the RECD is first tried with the patient's ear mould and the protocol is therefore not yet configured for using the SPL probe instead. In order to check or correct the protocol settings, select the RECD test, then right mouse button on the RECD test and select settings. The test settings now open in which we have to check the box that says use in situ SPL probe. Click OK and then use these settings. When using the SPL probe, the headset must be configured differently compared to normal REM measurements. Here you can see how to connect the in-situ tube and the thick speaker tube to the headset. With this different in-situ tube connected to the headset, we must first perform a tube calibration specific to the SPL probe. Press the tube calibration button, then select SPL probe. Next, follow the instructions on screen. After tube calibration, we are ready to take a measurement. Select the RECD test. Click Start to begin the RECD measurement. An instructional window will appear which describes the process of performing the coupler measurement. Insert the in situ SPL probe into the adapter connected to the coupler as shown in the image. Press OK. The frequency response to the coupler will then be displayed on screen. The next measurement is the real ear measurement. Select an appropriate ear tip and attach this to the in situ SPL probe. Insert the probe into the ear. Press OK to measure the real ear response using the SPL probe. The software automatically calculates and shows the RECD curve. Now the hearing aid can be verified in the coupler while the software uses the measured RECD to display results as if they were recorded on the real ear itself. This concludes this quick guide video on how to perform an RECD measurement using the SPL probe method.